looking at the, the problem of youth unemployment, which of course I think everybody recognises is one of the most serious economic and social problems we face as a country, it's become obvious that there are certain parts of the country where the problem is even worse than in other parts of the country, so-called unemployment hotspots. And we've identified 20 local authority areas, principally in the North, Midlands, South Wales, Scotland, where it is just a lot harder. I mean, it's hard enough for young people across the country, but it's a lot harder there to find a job. And what we're doing is we are basically accelerating the availability of support through the youth contract, which is a £1 billion uh, government programme, which I announced some months ago, uh, which gives every 18 to 24-year-old out of work the opportunity to earn or learn. We're basically accelerating the availability of that to youngsters in those particular areas. A big task for us in government is to get the message to businesses that this youth contract is available. Um, and there are some real incentives for businesses to, to, to mobilise and use the youth contract, notably a job subsidy of £2,275 uh, uh, if, uh, if uh, uh, an employer takes on a young person. And that is a straightforward incentive uh, paid for by the government, uh, paid directly to the employer to encourage them where they have a choice to choose in favour of, of young people.